Hey everybody, Mungo Dark Matter here. Today I'm going to show you how to use Cakewalk as a basic drum machine if you need it for practicing or uh, you need some beats to write some rap or whatever you want to do musically where you just need a drum machine. You can actually use Cakewalk as a simple drum machine uh, without going to a lot of trouble. So you can download Cakewalk from BandLab and BandLab uh, loads this app on your machine and you actually go to apps and you install Cakewalk from there. The thing you want to make sure of is to install the add-ons, which it will ask you when you initially uh, install um, Cakewalk, or you can go back here to where it says install add-ons and add them on later. Make sure you have Studio Instruments Suite installed because that's the suite that actually installs the drum machine uh, in uh, Cakewalk. So we're going to go here and so when we open up Cakewalk, this is what we see. We're going to open up an empty project. We're going to right click here on this column and we're going to go insert instrument. And then up under instrument, we're going to click on it where it says default here and we're going to go to drums and we're going to add the uh, SI drum kit. Uh, I have an extra VSDT down here for a uh, drum kit called Spark, but you won't have that more than likely. So you'll probably just see the uh, SI drum kit, or if you have other VSTs loaded, you may see some others in here as well. So we're going to click on that, and we're going to go uh, create the track. All right, I'm going to double click these, or just single click these uh, double arrows. And expand the track here right next to drum kit si drum kit it has a little button here we're going to click on that and it brings up our drum kit here it's a pretty nice little uh, vst drum kit right here but the nice thing about this is that you have these uh, different kind of preset up patterns in different genres in them and so if we pick like classic rock we can double click on this And it will and it will loop through it so we'll continually loop through so if this is what you want or this is a particular beat you want you can kind of you can practice to this uh, you can write raps or whatever you want whatever you need the drum machine for this is just a basic pattern that you can get very simple to set up you can also kind of save this as a project and uh, have it preset up so you just open up the project and you don't even have to create a track at the beginning of it. The other thing you can do uh, with this is you can actually drag these samples onto a track and, and uh, splice different samples together if you want a series of samples. So that's a uh, that's another nice thing you can do. Uh, but that's a little more complex than we want to get into in this particular video. We just want a basic beat. So we can use these basic beats. We can also drag them down into this grid pattern right here. So I can switch between the different beats. So if I want to practice a couple of different beat styles or I need to switch between them, I can put them in this grid pattern down here to use. And we can also use these controls up here to stop and start the beats. So that's just a, how you can use Cakewalk as a basic drum machine for whatever you need to use it for, practicing, writing rap, uh, writing songs where you want just kind of a basic beat behind your guitar or your keyboards or whatever to just to kind of give you uh, whether it's inspiration or just to help you keep time while you're practicing whatever i'm mungo dark matter and this has been dark matters whatever you do enjoy the day and i'll see you soon don't forget to like share and subscribe